Hi, I just wanted to do a quick video and tell you some important information. 25% um, of the population uh, is showing from Dr. Shoemaker's research uh, that they have a missing gene in their immune system called an HLA-DR. And having this missing gene in your immune system will not allow you to get rid of biological toxins like from mold and fungal spore, spores and from Lyme. And um, it's important to know when you're healing uh, from mold illness uh, if you have this genetic issue. Um, you can go on Dr. Shoemaker's site. It's www.survivingmold.com and he has uh, information on the HLA-DR gene, missing gene. And there's also a chart on there after you get the blood work done. There's a chart on there that explains uh, which you can see which missing gene that you have. Some are a little worse than others um, and harder to heal from. Um, but what happens is uh, when you inhale or ingest mold or fungal spore toxins or if you have Lyme disease, when you take antibiotics, when the Lyme bacteria dies, it produces a toxin. This part of the population, this 25% of the population that has this missing gene are not able to get rid of the toxins from from these from mold or fungal spores or from Lyme and you need to be on a toxin binding medicine. Um, what happens is your body starts to react um, when you inhale or ingest or a bit by a tick. Um, your body starts to notice that it has a foreign invader in it and it starts to produce an inflammation response in order to get rid of uh, the foreign body. and uh, this inflammation response doesn't shut off and then you get depleted of things that you need like one thing that you really need is um, something called MSH level uh, that's another test that Dr. Shoemaker has on there that you need to have run and it's called myelinocyte stimulating hormone and you need this for a lot of reasons and um, if you go on his website uh, it's got some great information on there and um, I just thought it was really important for people to know because 25% of the population has this and they don't realize it and um, they could be getting treated for symptoms um, and not being actually treated for what's causing the issue with their health problems. So thanks for listening. Bye.